Well, I'm a freaking crocodile. So basically, oh, it chomps. It chomps. It chomps. I love it. No, 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 no. Okay. Um. So basically, what it does is it's really only useful in underwater areas. Like we have to kind of crawl under the water to hide. Other than that, it's literally useless. Um, there is a couple areas where it gives you a little Easter egg and stuff. I love you. Hello, I'm Bobby the Spring Crocodile. How are you? All right. So we're going to change up to, I think, woodland and leaf is what we want for the next area. Something like that. Say, so take off our crocodile cap so we don't get brutally murdered by the crocums. Wait, do I have my thermals? I, no, I don't, because I'm stupid. Gotta get my crocums. Blah 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 All right, gotta get those leeches off my leg. All right, I was gonna say crotch, but then I realized it wasn't on my crotch. So there's, oh, this totally isn't dangerous at all. This isn't a trap of any kind. Meow. Oh, what? Meow. Meow. Oh my god, I didn't expect that. So yeah, there's traps in this area. And there should be a mine detector around here. Do I have a mine detector? Um, I don't know where the mine detector is. That's odd. Um, huh. I thought there was a mine detector. Yeah, you usually have a mine detector. Okay, something to note is that you can still get hit by this thing and it still does... It still, um... Hurts you. It doesn't, like... It's not inactive anymore. It'll still, if you walk into it, you're friggin' gonna get hurt. So we're gonna get some fruits. Our fruits, see? Yeah, I'm only probably... Oh, I used it in this LP. I lied. I told you I wasn't gonna use it, and I use it. I'm only gonna use it to, like, kill certain animals and stuff. Like, if I have to kill, like, a frog or something, I'm not gonna waste um, my bullets unless I'm gonna friggin' use a M19. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Alright, so this area, as previously noted by some random guard we interrogated, is covered in mines. Normally, you would have to use a mine detector to find the mines, but if you are a normal uh, Metal Gear Solid player like myself, you would do this. Oh, there's a claymore. Beep, 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 I got it, and it didn't explode, even though it was pointed right at me. So yeah, you can pick up claymores by just, um, putting them in your mouth, and going nom nom nom, and it automatically gives you them, no matter what way you're facing. So, um, if you have the mine detector, uh, it'll, like, when you get closer to these, it'll go, burp, 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 and it's really aggravating and really annoying, and you want to cut out your own ears when you listen to it, and, uh, that's about it. So there's a dog. Hi, dog. I hate you so much. You're the bane of my existence, and I'm literally, I'm highly, like, seriously, I'm going to kill this dog, because I hate this dog with my, all of my being when I play this game. Well, I guess all of Snake's being, because, okay, I'm walking backwards so I don't get into a claymore. I don't know what I'm trying to sing. This way is faster. Hehe, <laughs> hing. Okay, so... To get past the electric fence, which electrocutes you, obviously, you have to... Alright, I'm getting a little bit low on food. So, yeah, if you can interrogate one of the guards in this area, which there are very few of, you will get... Oh, hey, look, a claymore. I wouldn't have noticed that. Okay, so, if you take out your M19, which I hardly use, and you shoot this little box, it turns off the Majigger, which literally has pretty much no use. I mean, it's, it's, it's handy if you don't want to risk getting shocked, I guess, but really, I mean, it's not that hard to get not shocked. 
And there, the dog is now knocked out. And the the Mr. McGuffin here will come and inspect it. And I just realized I've been using third person camera mode all this time. And I'm gonna fix it as soon as I get on the other side of this fence, probably. Nope. Nope. Yes. All right. So a guard um coming this way. I'm gonna move over a little bit. He, he's probably gonna wake up the dog. Or he's not gonna come at all. Never mind. Okay, I'm just gonna put on this mode again. Because I like this mode. It looks nice. I love it. I want to marry it when I play this game. Okay, so really the only thing it does for you is it allows a shortcut, which is right here. And there's a man. I'm gonna shoot him in his pan, if you know what I mean. Okay. So there's a little cut right here. If you try to go through here while the electricity's on, it'll shoot you, obviously, enough. But, um... If you turn it off, you just get a shortcut. That's about it. It, gets, it lets you bypass the dog, I guess, if you don't want to shoot it, which is, really makes no sense. Why wouldn't you want to shoot a freaking dog? Unless you're, like, part of PETA or something. Okay. Then again, why would you be playing this game if you were PETA? Okay. Oh, wait. I have to shoot it with a boot. It. I really hope I don't kill this guy. Oh, God. I shot him. He's still sleeping. Where's this radio? Well, never mind. Sorry, you're probably gonna wake up with a very big pain in your shoulder. Um, yeah, I'll see you later. Uh, hope you don't die. Cause that would, uh, make me sad. And I would cry. That makes me rhyme. And now it's time to crawl in mud. And I don't wanna rhyme anymore, cause that makes me wanna shoot myself in the throat. So, there's mud here. Let's eat a fruit, because I'm dying of food poisoning, apparently. Galova was fairly tasty. Yeah, these Galovas. Oh, God. He's freaking, like, enjoying it a little too much. So, the Galovas will always instantaneously fill up pretty much to the brim, the sky brim. So, yeah, usually those... Whenever you're really low on health. So I suggest looking for fruit and trees a lot. Because that is your best source of um, food intake. And it's the least likely to give you poison. Obviously enough. Because if you get like a snake or like a spider. It's especially spiders. Spiders will almost always give you poison. Or food poisoning or diarrhea. Or dysentery. Whatever. Okay, I'm going to pick a camo that actually works for this area because I almost always get caught when I'm doing this. But then again, it's usually only because I got caught earlier and he's like, Oh, I got to call on our reinforcements. Is there any guards this way? No. Surprisingly enough, I'm doing amazing in this area. Like, literally. I've never done this good in this area, ever. Okay. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Ah! Get out of the mud. Why did you stop? What did you do that for? Do I have a, a dart in my butt? No. That's weird. I thought I saw a dart in my butt. So I'm going to use this um this viewpoint for a little bit. Okay. So, never mind. That's stupid. I hate it. Alright, so there's no guards here at all for a while. So if you come up here, you will get a camo. McDamo. Uh, I keep rhyming, and it makes me sad. Stop it! What are you doing? Ah! Alright, I got to the area. Who would have known that it only took one more try to get it right? All I had to do was use the sti the the control stick instead of pushing L2 because it, you know, kept messing up. Okay, we got Splitter and Uniform, which is usually a lot better than the red dots. Red dots! There's another frog in me, dog. I'm not gonna get him because I'm not going for frogs. Um, one thing I'm gonna highly suggest against is do not, under any, under any circumstance, was, <laughs> uh, under no circumstances should you try to kill those guys, because almost always, or knock out those guys, because almost always, they will always, like, oh, what's that? Oh my god, I'm gonna wake up my buddy. And then they'll just keep doing that until eventually you go into caution, because you've shot them so many times. So I would suggest doing that, and then you won't have to even bother with them. Because you should probably be able to find a hole in the ground or a bowl in the ground. Don't do that, snake. You're going to get killed. Uh, I'll, I'll jab him with a knife. Okay. 
here. Okay, closer, Snake. Oh, come on. Oh, I have to shoot him? Ugh, fine. Luckily enough, it does not make um the guards be like, huh? No! No! Don't walk this way, don't walk this way, don't walk this way, don't walk this way, don't walk this way. No! Good. And apparently he was far away enough to not get me noticed. No! Stop doing what's wrong. Nothing is wrong. Your mom is wrong. That's what it is. That's what I was going to say. That's wrong. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. No. Oh. No. Ah. Really? Oh, great. Eh, eh. There we go. 20 years later, and we finally, finally killed him. So yeah, they're guarding the entrance to this place. And you're probably thinking, oh, I could just mosey on in there. No, you cannot mosey on in there. There is a guard inside, and he'll be like, huh? There's a guy moseying on in here? On my shift? I don't think so. And then he'll shoot you in the friggin' mouth. And you'll cry, because you're dead. So, take him out first, and then do what you're going to do. If you really want to mosey on in here, turn around and just be like, bow, da, bow, da, bow, bow. I got a bone to pick with you. What the hell is that? Can I shoot those? What the hell does that do? What purpose does that have? None, that's what it does. That's what the purpose is, I mean. So... Hopefully, I'll be able to go over to that guy and interrogate him, because I love interrogating people. Because I love getting ice cream. Because apparently, getting ice cream requires you to do this. So I'm hoping he won't notice me. Forever. Huh? Huh? Oh, great. Who's that? Oh, come on. Really? Oh, come on. Really? Err. Oh, great. Dogs. 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 I'm gonna run now, because I don't want to get caught by guards. Even though I really want to, um, shake them down for stuff, I don't want to, um, die. Or get caught again. And, you know, I'm doing pretty good with not getting, like, 20-hour alerts like I did in the other games. Game. So yeah, something I want to note is that I really want to do a Metal Gear Solid 4 and 2 LP, but I don't know if I should. Post in the comments if you want me to do either of those games. If you want me to do Metal Gear Solid 1, please tell me and I will do Twin Snakes or Metal Gear Solid Original. If you really want me to do that one, I will. Okay, so I believe we have some White Phosphorus, White Phosphorus grenades. I don't know how to say that because I'm stupid. Cut in my ears. Disinfect the cut and then bandage it and then suture the cut and then cigar it. Yeah, that works. Um, styptic? Yeah, there we go. So, something that's nice. Oh, let me get my wife's phosphorus grenades. Or my, um, whatsoms. Do I have any actual grenades or do I just have like wasp phosphorus grenades? 